Okay, welcome back to Dark Soul Gaming and Farthest Frontiers. That's right, we are back continuing with our struggles building our settlement out on the wild frontier and we are just going to get straight into it as always. All right, so we've gone through an extra year. I went through one whole year. Um, nothing really happened. We didn't make any money, as you can see. We didn't really make much at all. However, what we did do, okay, let's have a quick look. I'm just going to pause it while we have a look at this. So we rented our two iron ore mines are up here. They both ran out. So we're on the on the scout for some more iron ore as well. Because we're gonna need that later on. And in this area over here that we explored at the end of the last episode, we found this mountain here. Now look at this. This is wonderful. It's got some iron and then gold and then iron and then iron and then gold and then iron. And then for something different, it's got some iron and some iron, 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 iron. So, we've put in an iron mine, and we've put in a gold mine. We're flattening this area here, and going to put another iron mine and a gold mine up here to get the gold from there, and the iron, and the iron, and the iron. And then maybe later on we'll come up here as well. But, that's got that going. Okay, so we've got a road coming over here, roughly in the vicinity, which we'll hook up now. Uh, where are we? So, uh, it's there, I think. there and then we've got there and there okay so it's got the road done uh, it obviously it's got to be built yet but that's planned that in so that that should be okay from that um, over here nothing else much has really happened other than the fact we've built two wagon shops um, both wagon shops have two people in each of it uh, because we're going to eventually need this over here. Now, I'm going to put the road as well from here. In fact, I'm going to go from there to there. Like that. And that, that's got a path back into here if we need it as well. Um, now, the other thing I wanted to do apart from that was look at putting in a storage in here. Now, um, bum, 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 bum. Where am I? Storage. Log stone wood planks. Store all items. Now, that's probably what I'm going to need in here to store these items. Now, finding a location that's going to work is probably. Oh, in there will work. So we're just going to get rid of those rocks. Okay. So that, that's there, and then we just put a road inside of that there. All right, cool. Well, that's going to keep these guys over here very busy because we've got lots of stone to get rid of as well. Okay, cool. Well, we're just going to leave that go. Uh, I'm going to bring it back up to two times speed. Uh, work areas are empty and need to be removed. Uh, okay, which one's that? You. Why are you empty? You're only empty of stone. You're not empty of timber, are you? No, there's plenty of timber there, so let, let's just keep you going. Thank you. Right, uh, you're not being... Right, neither of them are really needed, so I'm going to salvage that. Yeah. I'm going to salvage that. I'm going to take the rest of the out of there. I don't really need you here either. I'm going to salvage you. Or do I just move him? Um, no, I'm going to salvage you. Right. That'll give me some of the material back. Uh, hopefully some gold. Right, you are ready for compost to apply. So we're going to take some compost over here to the farm. And this one here needs to get the most. There we go. All right. Very good. Now, um, I've also tried to expedite our barn building as well. I've got five builders on each of these. Um, the gold is going to hold up, obviously, both of these. But, um, you know, we'll, we'll get that at least started. Ten villagers graduated. Yay! The school's working. Right, let's go to the market. Uh, it's going to slow down for the market. Now, what have we got here? What can we sell? Um, nothing. Right, what can we buy? Crossbows. Okay, that's, that's fine. Um, oh, I've got plenty of soap. Uh, actually, let's do 10. 
ourselves some soap. Not necessarily to him, but we've got other traders in here as well now. So uh, let's have a look and see what we can sell to this guy. Uh, nothing. Neither of them have got anything to, we, that they want to buy from us, which sucks because that means we can't make any money. Um, that really does suck. Oh, the, the, this will start coming in. So we've got 11 from him for soap. Soap for him. He's not buying soap, but he it's selling for eleven. So that's fair enough. Um, yeah, it sucks. He's really not after anything, which doesn't help. Uh, I'm gonna speed that up a bit so we get some product over here. Um, right, let's let's sell that. Oh, that's actually all right sell items right now let's have a good look at what we've got cases in that we do need mainly weapons and stuff like that at the moment apart from the gold is what we need um, nothing for you and nothing from you really so um, okay I'm gonna transfer that gold back to this town center because I'm gonna get the defenses back up and running and get all that uh, picked away. Villager has died. Okay, we had not. Wow, well, we had another two villagers leave us as well. But look at this. As you can see, the happiness is back. Look at this. Our food. We got food. Look at this. We got four months worth of food. Because um, our food's come back up, our happiness is coming back up. Right. All we got to do now is get our villagers defended. And oh, look, that that palisade's all finished, which is good. I'm happy with that. Um, okay, cool. They just need to be defended and have weapons. We need need more workers. Right. Come on, we just I need you to get over here with some weapons, guys. That's a priority. Okay. Now, what else is going on? Uh, school. That can probably continue, although I'm not so sure. I, I don't think I need the school. To be honest, I'm going to leave that there. Uh, no, no, no. Oh, that one. That was what I want. I'm going to leave the school. I'm not going to construct the school for the moment. Right, what are you doing? You've got no one there. Right, you have now. Um, everything else okay? we got over here. That's happening. Okay. What have we got over there? Hunter cabin over there. Alright. Um, let's. Well, actually, what have we got in the way of labourers? We've only got three labourers left. Man, I thought I had plenty of labourers. Um, oh, but I've got ten doing the cow barn, don't I? Cow barns. So, maybe... Actually, no, because they're, they're, they're going to be close to finished. So, once we've got them finished, I can set up their, their arable or their plot, and then... Um, it's just a matter of getting some, uh, what's that? Get some on you. Don't like the fact that we've got... No, I haven't got a healer. No, everything else is okay, but I've only got two labourers. So I'm going to dump my builders back to miners there. There we go. Uh, firewood splitters, yep, okay. Let's see how things go from there. All right. But I think we're in a reasonable position now. I just want to make sure that we've got... Yep, we, so we've got people over here now um, defending. All right, so, so they're going to help with defending, which is fine. So they're both fully sorted out. New villager born. Okay, happy with that. Um... I've got plenty of housing. Oh, let's have a look at the housing. How have we gone up here? Look at all this. They've, they've, up, they've up the homesteads. Look at them all. Looks like let's have a see where we're going now. Remember before we were at zero, now we're at 15. So we've got 15 um, homesteads. Um, so we are getting closer to being available to go to the next tier. Uh, and that will change a whole pile of things um, in relation to uh, what we can do in relation to... Uh, Building stuff. Um, 
Okay, I'm not selling any of that. Yeah, it's okay. Iron ore. Look at the iron ore I've got. Man. Um, right, I need some tools. So that's, that's what I need from the next um, merchant. I need one of these tools. So this, this tool here, the heavy tools. Um, we can't make them at the moment because we haven't got the foundry again. Um, so really sort of waiting on that to, to come into fruition. Right. Six months worth of food. A bonus. All right. Let's go see what else we've got that we can be looking at doing at the moment. Um, oh, the arborist. That's what I keep on forgetting to do. Right. So we've got the arborist. Now, the arborist is really good. Cool. Um, where have we put the arborist? I'm going to put the arborist fertility 100%. I put the arborist there. Okay, so the arborist. Let's let's put a road in. Put a road straight over to. Uh, to there. Right. Now the arborist is really cool because what we can do in the art with the arborist is we get a plot of land here and we can we can sow some fruit trees and and we harvest fruit from the fruit trees. So. See, this is the stuff that I haven't been doing. I haven't really made sure I've got everything running. Smokehouse. Uh, how am I going? Smokehouse. You know, I might put another smokehouse in. Um, because the other one is doing okay. But I don't think having another one in here is going to hurt us in any way. Can't put a road on there, but anyway, that, that's okay. Building needs more workers. Which building? The barracks. Yeah, okay. I I get it, but I need. Oh, actually. What we got? Okay, I can put another one in there. Cool. Healer, I've got a healer again now. That's that's good. All right, so we're fully populated. Everything's everything's populated nicely at the moment. Until we get our mines built and the power barns done and everything else. Uh, our uh, watchtower down here moved down here successfully, so that's going to be overlooking our, our cows. That's good. Coming back into winter again. Uh, got any compost down here? No. No, things, things are looking okay now. We're, we're sort of come back on the rebound a little bit, which is always good. Okay, you're, you're hunting, so you're okay. How are we going with our mine building? Very slow. That's okay, we haven't got much of the way resource. Oh, that, that's the thing I meant to say too. In that gear that we had in between the, this episode and the last episode, we also had 10, 10 immigrants join us, so that, that did help us out a bit too. We, we were short of people and that really helped out with getting some building done quickly. Um, right here we go through winter. Just fast forward through winter. 922 golds, that's okay. We've got enough gold to support our, our military and all that at the moment. Hopefully I'll catch the next time we get raided so I don't um, just lose buildings up before I realise the end of the raid. Alright, 150. So these guys are getting done, getting this job done as well, which is good. Things, things are actually going okay. What have we got? I'm not sure how I'm going to... I've been thinking about putting the palisade all the way around and do all the area, but I don't think it's going to really going to work. And then the other thing I've got, if I put a palisade around this settlement and then one around this settlement, then I've got to have a whole pile more people for defending. Um, so it's a Rob Peter Pay Paul type thing. Anyway, we'll, we'll work that out at some point. These guys are all building the road. 
you see. I'm sending stuff over here. Says good. Uh, what's he doing? Oh, you're working on the road. Yes, you're working on the road by chopping the trees out. Okay. All right. You need food. That's okay. You'll get the food eventually. Uh, oh, look at this. Our food again. So we didn't have, didn't have enough food to last us through winter, and now our happiness has dropped. See, see how quickly the happiness drops? Damn, it's like as if food's important or something. Ah. New year, year number 17. All right, it's got to start getting better soon, surely. Surely we're going to hit a point where all of a sudden things take off and we're, we're doing well. Now, we're in, in quicksand now. We're down to our waist. We're not, we're not totally screwed over yet, but we're getting close. Really just looking a bit scurvy. Great. Charles has grown up. Billy taxes collected. Okay. Let's go under our farm, our gardens. Travelling merchant has arrived. Okay, let's uh, again slow down the, uh, the time a bit. Let's have a look and see what we've got in here. Okay, so he's buying gold. Right, so let's sell the gold. Sell. Has he got the tools? He's got the tools. Right, so we want two. two. No more, no less. Buy and transfer. That means the windmill can start, which is good. Which hopefully means we're going to have more food coming in. Um, nothing else there to sell. He has got weapons. Um, I do need weapons, to be honest. Um, 230. I can only buy two weapons. I will just buy them anyway. Oh, actually, I've got more gold there. I could use that, but I'm not going to. Um, soap price has come down a bit. Uh, linen clothes. You know, I might just transfer all of those across and sell those. They're at a good price at the moment, or average price. Um, yeah, it's nothing, nothing fantastic, but I mean, it's this it is what it is. Why does it say five hundred? So I just like, I just, hmm, I just slid the scale. That's why. Buy some more weapons. Okay, that's all we need for them for that, from them for now. There we go. Here's the um, the windmill. So now then the windmill, if we've got enough people available, right, we'll take our grain and turn it into flour. Now have we got grain? That's probably the question. Um, certainly nothing at the moment by the look of it, so that's okay. And then the, the flour will then go into here and then they'll make the bread. So that, that, that's the production chain for that. That's all set up now, done. Good. Um, I'm going to get this going. I know I've only got 672 gold. Got a new merchant arriving now. So what's this guy going to take? Oh, I'm not selling tools. Jesus, I almost stuffed that up. Um, not selling that. He's got food. He's got the food that we really want. Oh, no. Right. Where are we being raided from? Uh, you, really? Are we being raided from here? So, you know how I said that we wouldn't get raided from down... Well, that's just happened. Um, flag combat area. Right, they're going to come out. Ring 
the belt. Hey, you guys. Attack these guys. Come on. Don't let them take out my bloody storage. Right, good. Much better. Okay. Right. Let's go back to trading. To, I'm going to sell them. It's just going to give me an extra 32 gold, but that's not much. I know, but hey, it's, it's what's there? Um, that's going to be it for that. All right. That's okay. We held off that raid. So return to barracks. Right. Didn't lose anyone, which is good. And more importantly, we didn't lose any buildings per se. We well, did a little bit of damage on the way through, but that's that's not that bad. Um, okay, still nothing going on in here. Because I'm a bit lower than 500 now, that's going to not happen straight away. Um, let's transfer that gold back out to the town storage. We just, uh, no, you know what? Not until I've got plenty of gold there. Because I also need 2,000 gold upgrade here. So I, I'm not, yeah, I'm not going to go hell for leather on the gold yet. All right. Now, let's see how things are going over here at our construction site here. Uh, nothing has moved by the Oh, they are actually... They are doing the flattening. Um, or have they done the flattening? I think the flattening is done. By the look of it. Right, let's see if we can put um, our resources up in here. So, I want to put iron... Yeah, that's going to work. Right. Um, I don't know if I'll get a road up there, but... Um, iron mine. There we go. I'm going to put a gold mine next to it. There we go. Right, now, can we get a road... should work we'll see we'll see how that goes we got a mine there so that's going to mine that all that all that all that gold all right so let's let's just see how things so that's building all right well we'll just see how that goes uh these are built over here which is fine now we don't have a road in here for these guys do we Now I can join up either way. So what we'll do is I'll put um, do we ever got the road on these guys? Um, the road there. Come on there. That way they can they can go either way. They can go that way or that way either or all right cool so let's just uh see how things are going so down here everything's okay i'm i'm been all this time doing this and now all of a sudden they're just not going to go down there Bastards. they're smart new villager em immigrated okay a new settler named briga has arrived attracted by the growing prosperity of your town to increase the rate of immigration ensure that you have surplus food and housing available We've got plenty of, plenty of housing, and I've got a little bit of food now, so hopefully we'll get some more immigrants. Well, in a way I hope we get more immigrants, but the more immigrants we get, then the more I'm going to have to spend on, um, or more food we've got. So I have issues with that, haven't we? Anyway, that's okay. Alright, um, so much iron ore. I really want to get that foundry running. 
Uh, what we got down here? This is still isn't done. Uh, you're done over here, though, aren't you? So you're. you're done over here. What have you got in there? You got 13. So you got timber, you got a bit of stone, you got a bit of clay. are a bit slow at the moment. Let's just fast forward a bit and see how things uh, go. Okay, so the, sec the second smokehouse is in there. It's done, which is good. I'm, I'm wondering if it's worth putting in a diff another Fletcher. Um, I think I might, you know. I, I see the benefits of having more Fletchers. Um, oh, another Fletcher to produce more uh, items. Uh, Fletcher building. Let's go, let's just put it in there and just, just go, go, go. Oh, what are you guys doing? Making my soap, right, okay. charcoal instead we, we do have charcoal being uh, stocked up and we can also put in a charcoal burner um, so we can burn the wood and make charcoal and then use that but I'm not sure why they're not, um, not using that at the moment but anyway predators are attacking okay where are you attacking Here we go. Ah, orchards and arborists. Right, let's get this sorted. So, um, the arborist building here, okay, and there are no fruit bearing trees, right? So, let's put some fruit bearing trees in. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go. I'm not sure if I'll catch it with it just being inside there, but I'm going to put them there anyway. One there, one there, and I'll put one there. Okay. Right, now we're going to put a uh, peach tree. Okay. All right. 
So we're just gonna see how that goes. All right. Hopefully that'll give us some more uh, some more food. Okay, what are we going to do here? Still haven't got any uh, any grain. Why haven't we got any grain? Maybe no, we just don't have any grain. Um, that's problematic, but anyway. You're doing okay there. Cool. Only three labourers. We need some more immigrants. Food is up at the moment. I'm thinking as well, we've only got more than one or two fishermen over here. We got one fisherman. That's the fishing shack. I'm gonna put another fishing shack in. I'm gonna get some more fish. Because I got I got this shoal of fish here. So I think that's uh, what we should do. A fishing shack. Okay, bring that down to there. The path in, there we go. Right, cool. We'll let him get built. A new traveling merchant. Awesome. Right, what can we sell to him first off? Right, we can, we can sell soap. Let's let's just sell all the soap we can. Let's make some money. Uh, my shoes are down a bit in price. Stone. What can we buy? We can buy flour. Now flour is probably going to be good because we can buy make a whole pile of bread. Some bricks. We're going to need that later on for upgrading, but I'm not going to worry about buying any at the moment. Um. So I'm going to sell this, and then I'm going to buy some flour. 700. There we go. That'll start getting some bread made. So the rest of this. Okay, 577. Um, I want more bread. Beans. No, I'm gonna. I am gonna do that because that's gonna help us with food, most definitely. Um, what have I got? I've got five seventy-seven. Here we go. Iron transfer. All right. Thank you very much, Mr. Trader. <clears throat> You've uh, helped me with my flour production or supply for my bakery, so that's good. So now I should have some more food. New traveling merchant is right. Right. Okay. What have you got? Trader number two. Okay. Well, I can sell some of that. Gets me some more money in the, in the bin. Uh, you've got weapons. Okay. I need weapons. Um, okay. I'll sell the little bit of soap we've got produced now. I'll sell that. And weapons are 78. Um, so I can buy a few weapons. Okay. Right, thank you very much. You've done the right thing too. Okay, so there we go, 180 bread. Now, bread doesn't last long, but that's okay. I mean, we, we need to, to supply around everywhere, and that will be okay. Alright. So look at that, look at that grain, that bread that's in there. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Right. Let's have a look at this. Ah, here we go. So our first cow barn is ready. Set the grazing area. So now we set the grazing area now. As you can see here as we move it, the fodder bonus uh, comes up to say what fodder bonus we get. Now here on the hill we're not getting as much, but the best one was just down here, 88, 89%, so that's what we're gonna do. There we go. Now, the problem I'm gonna have here is this guy. Is, now I've got the arborist taken up um, where I was gonna put it. So, um, you know what, I might actually just, um, I might cancel that. And then what we'll do 
is we'll put another one in at some point and, and fix that up. Right, I need someone in there like that. Uh, two labourers, that's okay. So I've got you back in there. All right, uh, villager has died, new villager born. Oh man, is it? Why is it the foragers that die all the time? Right, close all those. Okay, let's see how things are going now. Um, 76. That, that needs to transfer. I don't know why that's sitting in there, but anyway. Um, okay, cool. Well, that's, that's fine. Um, but I think that's where we might leave this episode. I think we're um, we're getting pretty close to being happy where we're at. Uh, we've got all this stuff over here being built. Oh, there we go. We've got the forage there is built. He needs a road as well. Um, so Tyria is busy butchering meat, which is good. Um, but yeah, we need we need this stuff built. And, uh, and then we should be tickety -boo. But what we might do actually here, I might need to put in one of these temporary housing, temporary shelters. in here somewhere. Down here. I, want, I, I don't know if that's going to help or not. We'll see. We'll see if that's going to help. But anyway, that, they, they may need some shelter here because uh, they are a bit, a bit far away from the housing. Um, so we'll just see how that goes. I'll put it there and just see and if it if it's not needed, then we'll demolish it. If it's needed, then uh, all well and good. All right. Um, so I think we're in a reasonably good place. Uh, our food has certainly stockpiled up, which is good. Um, and uh, we're in a, in a fairly good place there. The only thing we, we don't have is... Uh, oh, now these, are get, these guys are getting unhappy because our desirability has dropped. Um... Now, I don't know why the desirability would have dropped, to be honest. Um, all the more reason why we need to put this in. Uh, although, what we can do is we have got the little gardens. Uh, maybe I'll just put a few of those in. Decorations. Which one was it? Uh, small shrub. Small garden. Does give a desirability increase. Um, those in and see if they uh, see if they help out they don't give much of a, an increase but just a little bit might be enough to stop these guys from downgrading so we really don't want to downgrade once I build this though that might be, might be an issue and I can probably get rid of all the corroding that I was going to there alright cool all right, well, that's it. We're going to leave it there at winter, and we're going to come back in the next episode. We'll finish the winter off, then we'll come back in spring, and uh, we'll see where we sit at that point in time. But I think we're, we're starting to sort of come back on the other side and, and do okay. Did our Fletcher get good? It did. So we should start seeing a lot more uh, bows and arrows. So I'm going to go one to three. There's no point making six to two. It's the same as three to one, isn't it? Right, um, so we've got that going. That's all good. Um, I've got oh, I've got I've got some extra people. Right, so we can put the next person in here. Uh, unfilled. Why is that unfilled? It's interesting. I don't know why that's unfilled. Um, you know, I have to have a look at the rat catcher and see why. Um, but anyway, that's that's what we're going to with, Like I said, so we'll we'll see how things go. All right, those these buildings are being. Uh, the gardens have been done pretty quick, so we'll see if this goes as we're uh, signing off. So, anyway, like I said, thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, press that like button. If you didn't press the dislike button, that's okay. Um, don't forget, you can also join us on Twitch, Twitter. No, not Twitch. Twitter, Discord, Twitter, Discord, and Facebook. Um, 
and details down below. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed to the channel. We are on the road to 5,000 subs and we would love to have you join us. Um, and make sure you press the alarm notification icon as well so you're made aware of when new videos are available on the channel. And apart from anything else, take care of yourselves and your loved ones and we'll see you again very, very soon. Back here at Duck Solar Gaming and Farthest Frontier. See you all later.